Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Reviews. In this video, I will show you the top 10 city tweaks compatible with the new iOS 10.1.1 jailbreak. So as you probably know by now, the iOS 10.1.1 jailbreak has been released, but it's still on beta and it's unstable and it has bugs, but you can go ahead and jailbreak if you want. If you don't know how to do it, I will leave the link right down below in the description of this, of this video, which shows you how you can jailbreak your iOS 10.1.1 device. Now, as I said, the jailbreak is still on beta and it only works on certain devices. So be very careful if you decide to jailbreak your device, you gotta be very careful with what you install on your device because you might mess up your device and then have to restore. So first of all, I didn't want to make this video because I don't want to push people into jailbreaking their devices with this beta jailbreak, but I had a lot of requests on Twitter to make a video like this, so I will go ahead and do it. So these are the top 10 city tweaks compatible with iOS 10.1.1. Advanced Settings 8. This tweak will give you access to internal settings of your iOS device. So all you have to do is just tap and hold the settings icon and you will see this pop up and here you have different kind of settings that you can change to your device using this tweak which is pretty awesome. Now normally you won't have access to these internal settings but this tweak allows you to do that. So you have here all these sections. So you have like parallax, you have icon animations, control center, folders. So let's go to one of them. Here, if you go to folders, you can enable pinch to close, you can enable nested folders, which means that you can put a folder inside a folder and stuff like that. You have here a lot of sections to choose from and customize your device. Barrel. This is one of the most famous jailbreak tweaks ever and it will add these awesome animations when you swipe through pages on your home screen. You can see how cool this looks. So when you install this tweak you will get this icon on your home screen. If you go here you can go ahead and pick any animation that you want for your device. Now if you don't want to have barrel you want to disable it all you have to do is just choose here normal no effects and you will disable barrel now just notice that the barrel is a paid tweak which means that right now you can't buy it but if you have purchased it in the past you can go ahead and sing in into your Cydia account and download barrel on your ios 10.1.1 device blurry badges this tweak allows us to customize the look of the badges on your icons so you can see here the the badge of the mail app is blue and is blurred so the badge will be blurred and also will take the main color of the icon of that app and set it as the color of the badge so you can see here it looks pretty awesome so let's jump to the settings of this week we have a few settings here you can change the border size the border color and also with the slider right here you can change the transparency of the badge Cask. This tweak will add these awesome animations when you swipe through table views like this on the settings or other apps. It supports most of the stock apps of your iOS device so you can see these cool animations. Now to change them you will need to go to the settings of this tweak so you go to Cask, go here to style and you can change here between different styles and you can also set the duration of the animations right here. So to install this tweak you will need to add a repo which you will find in the description of this video. Date in status bar. This tweak will add the date on the status bar of your device. So besides having the time on the status bar you will also have the date here on the left side of the status bar. So to install this tweak you will need to add a repo which you will find in the description of this video. The tweak is pretty simple and it doesn't have any options to configure. Icon renamer. This tweak allows you to rename any of your icons to any name that you want. All you have to do is just tap and hold an app just like when you want to delete one of them and then all you have to do is just tap here on the icon and as you can see here you can enter any name you want for that icon and then just click apply and it will change the name of that icon. Power tap. So when you go to the power down menu of your device all you have here is slide to power off. But with this tweak you can just tap here and it will change the button from slide to power off to slide to reboot, slide to respring or slide to go to the safe mode. So if you jump to the settings of this tweak here you will have three buttons where you can enable or disable any of these sections. So you have reboot, respring and also safe mode and you can also rename them right here just enter any text that you want. Round dock. This is a simple tweak for the dock of your device and what it does is that it will make the edges of the dock rounded and as you can see it looks pretty cool. So it's a simple tweak on the settings of this tweak all you have here is an enable button where you can enable or disable this tweak. 
Swipe for more. This tweak allows you to easily install or delete packages from Cydia. So all you have to do is just swipe like this and you can go ahead and install a package on your device. Or if you want to remove one of them, slide like this, you can reinstall it or you can go ahead and uninstall it directly from here without having to go through the page of the tweak and clicking uninstall or install. You can do it right here from the list view do you just swipe like this and you can go ahead and take these actions very quickly you can install and uninstall tweaks tactful this tweak will add 3d touch support for Cydia so when you are on the tweaks list here on the changes where you see the new tweaks or when you search for a tweak you can go ahead and tap here on a tweak just like this to peek into this tweak or you can swipe up and then tap here remove or install or remove if you have already installed that tweak on your device and of course you can also pick and pop so you tap here once and you tap once more harder to pop into that tweak which is pretty cool so that's it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the tweaks for more videos like this make sure you subscribe now the jailbreak for ios 10.1.1 should be released any day now on the final version so you can go ahead and jailbreak your device so you will see a lot of these with videos here on my channel so make sure you subscribe and don't miss any of them so that's it for this video also don't forget to follow me on my social media you will find all the links in the description of this video